A big construction project that's causing some major headaches for drivers and businesses near Decatur and Oki, and it's about to get worse. Action News reporter Elizabeth Gadley is there live right now to explain the problem. Elizabeth. Steve, people who live and work in this area say it's already a nightmare. Take a look around me. You can see there's all of these cones, there's barrier walls, there's even a bunch of construction equipment in the roadway. It's difficult to navigate in this area. And starting on Monday, there'll be even more closures. A lot of our customers actually are complaining that they can't get into the store because the streets are blocked off. Plenty of others avoid the area altogether. The city is even suggesting people use Sahara, Charleston, Jones, or Valley View to get around the construction zone. ARCO employee Erwin Gastelum says it's hurting business. It's actually brought our business down to the point where my hours have been cut and I think all the other businesses down on Decatur in general have just been affected. This whole mess is just the beginning. The situation is going to get worse. Starting on Monday, Oki will be closed on the east side of Decatur and that's going to last for four weeks. City crews are working to improve storm drains and sewer lines in the area. It's a $29 million project. I guess it's necessary that they're doing this because we do need more storm drains and they do need to be enlarged, but it's a big mess. And he's not just talking about traffic congestion. Cars are cutting through parking lots, driving through construction areas they're not supposed to, and at times ending up in the wrong lanes. Idiots like that cause accidents and then that delays the rest of us. For Jessica Crank, it goes far beyond a minor inconvenience. She feels the area is now a hazard. Yeah, it's, it's going to cause a lot of, I can see an accident happening from it. Oki will be closed for just four weeks, but this entire construction project isn't slated to wrap up until September of next year. Reporting live near Oki and Decatur, I'm Elizabeth Gadley, Channel 13 Action News. Thanks, Elizabeth.